friends last year i have uh, written a story in the bitter india about the ongoing discrimination with the environment education and the school level the colleges level and even at the research and development level and this discrimination is continuing at the level of providing employment to the environment degree holders i was thankful to the better india that they have placed such a story describing the co resources of uh, environment education in india in 2015 the paris climate agreement was signed and two other major development happened in 2015 one was adoption of uh, sustainable development goals and second was the sunday framework on uh, disaster risk reduction and this three ways applicable to 2015 to 2030 now the paris climate agreement is binding from uh, 2020 but why i am talking on uh, this coming 2015 to 2030 it's quite relevant and very significant as part of uh, the environmental concern and what we are watching right now in delhi and uh, the significant urban flooding uh, situation in uh, 90% cities of india and in around the world as well that the situation is quite drastic and when you see the infrastructure of environment education at the school level at the college level and the university level it's been boosting it's been like that the education is teaching you to get away from the nature so when we are not con- considering the aspect of the environment and we are talking much or much at the global level about the environmental concern the climate change and whatever is going on it's worthless and education which departs you away from nature is a kind of best throw that education system into the dustbin and come with a plan a structure where ed- your education system would bring you close to nature you should understand your responsibility your contribution towards making this planet a healthier a space to live friends what i'm talking about that the government is not providing spaces to environment degree holders they are not even at the private teacher primary level law primary structure of the school where teachers are both appointed to teach environment education and they are even from uh, the mathematics section the science section and even social sciences people are teaching uh, the environment paper to their students this is a critical phase where a life sciences student has been appointed to deliver lecture to environment degree holders so what is the need of the environment education in india despite there is a remarkable judgment very historic judgment by supreme court to appoint environment degree holders at uh, various species of uh, 
formal and non-formal label of the environment um, uh, professions, even um, teaching and non-teaching uh, label as well. But the government is not responding to the judgment. The judgment was the core behind the aspect and significance of environment education in India. Friends, I am just telling you to get united. Ask your representative, ask your ministers, ask your chief ministers, ask your prime minister, the HR minister, the minister of environment, forest and climate change, government of India, why they are sowing such amount of discrimination with you guys. I am standing with you. I have continuously been writing you with this environmental issue aspect. I have continuously been supporting you through my writing and through my continuous efforts to raise this issue of environment education and for the rights of environment degree holders in India. Get united and fight against this anomaly, fight against this discrimination at by and large level within the government sector. And even they are being harassed and are discriminated by the private sector's consultancies as well. So come and get united. I will come with you with another video next time. Thank you and goodbye.